Want to make sure you never miss a Kindly Kian video again? Be sure to subscribe and hit that bell to turn on notifications. I told you what I know, and it wasn't very good. That was one of the creepiest things I've ever heard. Hello everybody, I am Kindly Kian, and welcome back to... Granny? This Something happened to Granny. Something very bad <laughs> happened to Granny. This is Granum. This is if uh, if Venom took over Granny, I guess. I'm actually really excited to see what this looks like. This is another mod by Dr. Hack, and I don't think it looks like the the Venom that you see there in the background. So let's just let's just jump in here and see what this is all about. <laughs> I'm actually really excited about this one. This is gonna be good. I don't know all that much about Venom, like the comic book character of Venom. I do believe that at one point, well, okay, let's start with what Venom actually is. I know that Venom is an alien, and it's like a, it's like a symbiote, right? Is that what they call it? Basically, it's, it's symbiotic, so like it has to attach itself to some other living creature. But whoever it attaches to, like, gets superpowers or something like that. And I think at one point, it did that to Spider-Man. And so that's why, like, it has all, like, the Spider-Man-y abilities or, or something. I don't know. I don't know the whole story of Venom here. But uh, apparently, at some point, Venom took over Granny. Oh, my gosh. That is horrifying. That is so scary. What is that? Oh, that's from the new Venom movie. Okay. So, yeah. That's, that's Venom. And, and it's scary. <gasps> you made a scary noise. That, that was not Granny's voice. Oh my gosh, it's got new voices. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, so we got a little glimpse there of, of Granny, of Granum, Venom Granny. Anyways, uh, it's real freaky looking. Yeah, really, really freaky looking. Uh, let's see if we can get a better shot here. So I'm going to go ahead and drop the bottle there on the ground. And we're going to wait for Granum to show up so that we can get a nice, nice shot of, of Granum in all of her glory. Here she comes. Oh, boy. Oh, you're going the other way. You're, you're leaving me. Wait, you're supposed to, you're supposed to, okay, fine. I'm just going to run out and we'll get to see Granum a little bit later. In the meantime, let's just do some exploration here. Oh, my gosh, this is so creepy. It's so dark. <laughs> Is this really what Venom would do to Granny's house if it attached itself to Granny and became Granum? Put weird, scary spiders all over the walls and stuff? Yeah. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We gotta go see the car, actually. She just made a noise. That was freaky. That did not sound like normal Granny. I think that it was the same, like, dialogue. She said the same things. But she said them in a very creepy voice. I don't love that. I really don't love that. It scares me. What is that? Is that more weird, like, Venom art? Venom's so scary. Ew! Oh! He's coming! Or she's coming! Or something like that. Dang! She looks real, real spooky. Okay, you know what? Get in the- Oh my gosh! The Granny Mobile! The Venom- The Venom Mobile! Or something- Are you- Did you see me? You didn't see me, right? You did not see me. We got a little glimpse of of Granum there. You heard that. There's no denying that we heard that here. Let's let's jump out and oh, he didn't see us or she didn't see us. Maybe we can put Granny Venom in the in the sauna. We can try doing that. I need something to lure her in though. Oh, the weapon key. I definitely don't want to use that. Oh, here here she comes. Holy cow, look at that face. That is a very, very creepy face. That smile. <laughs> oh my gosh. That is so creepy. Okay. Oh no, I got hooked up on the stairs. Really didn't want that to happen. That, like, that smile that goes from, like, ear to ear. It's so creepy. So, okay, we were talking a little bit about, like, the lore of Venom, right? You guys are going to have to help me with this in the comment section. Because, like I said, I'm not too familiar with the story of Venom. I do believe that at one point, Venom 
took over Peter Parker, Spider-Man, and like absorbed his abilities and I don't know I don't know exactly what he does but like he becomes one with whoever he attaches himself to and then somehow Spider-Man got freed from Venom escaped Venom I don't know what he did but then Venom found a new host and I think that new host is like Eddie Booker or something like that Eddie something or other tell me if I'm wrong I I really don't remember. And I do believe that in the new movie that's coming out in like a week, that's the character that is in the movie, is the Eddie guy. But don't hold me to that, because I really don't know. And I don't even know if Spider-Man is in the new Venom movie. It, I mean, it seems like it would make sense if he was. I mean, Venom is kind of like Spider-Man's arch nemesis, isn't he? They're like two peas in a pod. Best friends for life. BFFs. <gasps> no, Venom. You're so sneaky. You're so sneaky. Oh, my gosh. He's right behind me. Look at that poster. That is really, really scary looking. Okay, you know what? Stop. Stop chasing me. Please. Are you still chasing me? He stopped chasing me. Oh, my gosh. That's so good. Okay, I know that the weapon key is down here. This is what I really came down here for, but I got distracted by all the Venom lore. Oh, you're down here. Okay, you know what? I'm going out this way. I'm leaving. Please don't get me. Please don't get me. Please don't get me. <sighs> he didn't even see me. Oh, okay. And here's the weird thing. I don't know whether to call Venom a he or a she. I guess technically Be Venom isn't a he or a she. It's just whoever it's attached to. So so it's Granny. It's a she. I should stop calling Granum a he. It's a she. Because it's still Granny. Somewhere in there. Could you imagine if Granny and Venom joined forces... And Granny actually got, like, the superpowers that Venom provides to her. That would be absolutely terrifying. As if Granny isn't already messed up enough. Where are you, Granny? I made a noise. Why aren't you coming after me? <gasps> there you are. Yep, okay. I wanted to get to the weapon, but I knew that I had to lure Granum out of there so that we could get our chance, seize our opportunity, and run over to the secret area. Although I really didn't have to go this way, did I? I could have I could have gone a different way. Th are these skulls? Are there just skulls all over this room? That's that's messed up, dude. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. All right. Granum. I got your antidote right here. Your medicine. Come at me. Oh, there you are. <sighs> wow, that is scary. That is so freaky. Ah! Why are you so gross looking, Granny? Let's actually, since the book is over here, let's go see if the statue is any different. I know these modders like to change up the weird statue in this room. Oh, Iron Man and Venom hanging out. I don't know if that ever actually happened. Although, knowing comic books, like, everything has happened at least once, right? There's nothing special here. This is just the weird statue. I have no idea. I also want to see the spider, of course. Like... That's at the top of the list of things to do as well. Um, I don't know if Granum is awake again. She probably is. Oh my gosh, it's so dark. I can barely tell if I was running up the stairs. That's kind of messed up. Is there anything going on over here? I want the special key. Okay, there's the car key. That's definitely a start. Let's go ahead and put the bridge down. And you know what? Let's, uh, let's knock this down so that it kind of throws Granum off. Off the scent, although she'll still come up here, won't she? Yeah, she's still gonna come up here. Oh no! Messed that one up, didn't I? It's already day four. Granum, why are you so gross and mean to me? Why can't we be friends? Maybe I'm Spider Man. So Granum has trapped me inside of her house because I'm Spider Man, we're arch nemesis. Yeah, okay, I like the sound of that. I get to be Spider-Man in this mod. Perfect. Okay, grab this as quickly as possible. Please, faster. She's gonna come. Granum. Oh, that is freaky. I do not like that voice alteration that has been done to Granum. Nope. Oh, gosh. I thought for a second that I was going down, but I survived. And now we get to gaze upon all the glory that is Granum. There you go. Why does Venom have the, like, the spider symbol? Why is that? Is that because he absorbed 
Spider-Man at one point, and he just kind of adopted that. He's like, I'm the evil alter ego of Spider-Man. Or is it just because it's cool and it looks cool? Probably more that. If you know, let me know. I want to know. Oh, Spider-Bear. Spider-Bear. Spider-Bear does whatever a spider bear does, which is just sit in the corner on top of the shelf, doing nothing until I pick him up. And then I pick him up and Granny gets really mad. Mm-hmm. That there was a kindly key and original, I know. <laughs> if this whole YouTube thing ever falls apart, I got options, right? I can, I can write songs for superheroes because I know how much they love them. Here, I'm going to shoot you in the back, just like that. You weren't expecting that, were ya? Stinky granum. All right, I'm gonna grab this tranquilizer dart and then we're gonna go upstairs and we want to find the special key because I really do want to see the spider. I like it when the modders... Oh, there's the special key, beautiful. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and drop this in the main area so that we can get back to it relatively easily and then let's grab the special key and also, we'll just check these cabinets real fast just to see if there's anything else hiding in here. Although, I am I am stretching my time here. Uh, we did find the winch handle in there, so we can always come back to that. I don't necessarily, like, intend to beat it. I don't have to beat it. But I would like to beat the mod. Give it a shot, you know? So, let's go up into the spider room. The spider is the same, isn't it? It looks almost exactly the same. I think what we're going to have to do is get the meat and um, and check out this spider a little bit more closely. It looks like the painting's not any different either. I found a piece of the painting. It's just Granny. Oh my gosh! You! You were right there! Why? <laughs> he was right there. Sneaking up on me. Using your super venom powers. <laughs> I don't know if venom can actually shoot spider webs. Can he? Maybe he can. Again, I have no idea. I don't really know the entire story of Venom. I told you what I know, and it wasn't very good. That was one of the creepiest things I've ever heard. Do you want to play hide and seek? <laughs> oh, that voice is not cool. Not cool. You're going to eat me now. Because that's what Venom does. I think. Maybe? Does Venom eat people? He's got sharp teeth. Seems like, you know, they'd be pretty effective at eating people. Just saying. Okay, let's go back. Let's just change the difficulty to easy, I guess. Because I'm a big baby. And uh, let's try to beat it here on easy. I can beat it on normal. I just, I get distracted and I'm looking at everything and oh, almost dropped my tablet. You know, stuff like that. It gets in the way of actually beating the level. So let's beat the level. Let's see the ending of Granum. Spoilers. Because it might actually be the same ending to the new Venom movie that's coming out. They, they might be exactly the same. I'm just giving you guys a heads up. But that is not true. It's not going to be the same as the ending of the new Venom movie. These have nothing to do with each other. But you never know. You just got to throw out those spoiler warnings. People don't like to get spoiled. This could be comic book canon right here. Marvel's watching this right now. Marvel Studios. I know you guys are watching. Disney. Yeah. And you're going to take that song that I wrote earlier, aren't you? That's going to be the ending credits song. The Sp Spider Bear. Spider Bear song. It's a good song. Wrote it myself. I know it's good. Anyways, I guess we can put together the shotgun. I found the barrel of the shotgun right off the bat. Ooh, and uh, the uh, the center piece. I don't know what it is. The trigger, right? Someone corrected me in one of the videos. I keep calling the back of the shotgun, which is the stock. I keep calling it a hilt. Hilts are not for guns. Hilts are for swords. But I'm just, I'm dumb, and I probably will continue to call it a hilt. I'm just warning you guys ahead of time. Oh, that's not good. I made noise and I don't want to make noise. I don't know what you were right behind me. Of course you were because you're a creep like that and you're a weirdo man. That altered voice thing, though, that it does with Granum's voice. Not a big fan. Super, super spooky. All right, I'm trying to get back to the trigger so that we can put that piece together. And then we just need to find the stock. 
Not the hilt. Oh, that's real nice. Put a bear trap right on the staircase. Huh? Real cool. Real neat trick. That makes things super easy for me. How does it make it super easy for me? Well, it means that I just won't go up those stairs. So there you go. Oh, the weapon key. Wait a second. All the items are in the same exact spot that they were last time. As far as I can tell. Kind of weird. Most of the time the mods still randomize where the item locations are. But I wonder if uh, something got funky with this one. And they're all in the same spot no matter how many times you restart. I don't know. Yeah, the book's right there. And then I bet you the special key is in the microwave. I bet you one of the winch or the winch handle is inside of one of the cabinets in the kitchen. I bet you spider teddy's in here. See, that's a little leading because uh, spider teddy is always in here. I heard a creepy laugh. Where are you, Granum? Where are you at? You just put a bear trap down? Put a bear trap down. <gasps> I hate that. That corner. I think I've died going around that corner more times in this game than I've died anywhere else in the game. Someone go back. Go back to all my videos and count how many times I've died in that spot. Because it's awful. Alright, let's try to do this little maneuver. Where we, where we throw the bottle, right? Make a noise. And then you stand behind the door. I love this. Not even Granum can see through this little trick. The ultimate tactic. Or maybe she can. Because she's not coming. Alright, try this again. Drop the bottle, make the noise, hide behind the door, and wait patiently. There she is! Go check out that bottle. It's making noises. You should really investigate. Alright? You investigating? Good. Good Granum. I went the wrong way. I did not want to go this way. Are you behind me? You're, you're gonna start coming after me, aren't you? Because I just rang the bell. This is not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go back to my... Tranquilizer darts! No. No. You sneaky Granum. Oh my gosh, that was way too close. Way too close for comfort. Let's get back upstairs. Let's get back to where we dropped our crossbow. Come on, where you at, crossbow? Crossbow, there you are. There you are. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick up the tranquilizer darts. Please don't kill me. Granum. This is going to be right around the corner. Are you going to be over here? Granum, hello? You're not here. Where are you? I'm gonna hit the hanger. I'm gonna knock down the hanger. Come here. Shoot you. Yeah, go to sleep. Okay, it's good for you. It's good. Sleepy time. Enjoy your sleepy time. You're out for two minutes. It's wonderful. Now I have all the time in the world to do whatever I want. So I'm gonna knock down this screwdriver because I'm a cool dude and I'm gonna miss. Let's try that again. There we go. Much better. All right. Time to see what's in the screwdriver cubby. The safe key. Okay. What's inside the safe? The pliers. These are very important. All right. Go ahead and cut that. And then we'll cut the one upstairs right there. And then I think we'll go grab the hammer. So let's go ahead and put the pliers right there. And step in a bear trap. Totally intentional. I totally meant to do that. It's all part of my master plan. Grab the hammer. All right. Grandma might be waking up now, so I'm a little bit nervous, but we're just going to get as much done as we possibly can in this moment. We're going to run across the bridge, take care of this situation right here, and we really don't need the wrench because I don't want to get out using the car. I want to get out through the front door. I want to see that ending with uh, with Granny, Granum. So we really didn't have to do that, which is kind of a bummer, but that's okay. Found the meat. Okay, so we can figure out what's going on with the spider. Oh my gosh! Okay, yep, uh, Granum was awake and uh, decided to hit me with a bat. Has super strength, can eat people whole with those very sharp teeth, and decides to use a bat. Alright, so I got my crossbow back. However, I don't know where the dart was that I shot Granum with. So this is a bit of a problem. I've got to get back upstairs, please! Oh, she got me. She got me good. Where are you? There you are. I'm gonna shoot you, okay? Alright, I hope you don't mind. Just go to sleep. We don't like you. You're very annoying. Alright, let's explore the kitchen. Uh, actually, the special key is probably in here. Yep. So, what we should do is open up the spider room and then take the toilet meat. 
from the toilet and give it to the spider so that we can actually see the spider in all of its glory. And we can also get whatever item is hiding behind the spider. I guess I kind of understand why the uh, mod maker wouldn't have changed the spider from the default looking spider because honestly the default looking spider kind of looks like it would fit the whole venom kind of look all right let's do that so yeah spider looks exactly the same very interesting all right let's uh grab the padlock key we need that and let's get out of here before the spider comes back he finishes his food and then he goes after you all right we get that open and uh i think all we have left is to find the master key and I have no idea where that would be if I had to guess though I would say it's probably in the playhouse so what we should do is get the winch handle and figure that situation out but first I'm gonna wait for Granum to wake up again and I'm gonna shoot her there she is go to sleep nobody likes you all right grab the winch handle and let's see what's inside of the well Okay, it's one of the cog wheels. So actually, we have both of the cog wheels because the other one is in the bathroom sink. So really, all I need to find is the playhouse key. And the playhouse key might actually be in the trunk of the car because we found the car key. Oh, no, playhouse key is right here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> figures is the first place that I look honestly had no idea it was there I know it doesn't look that way but I seriously had no idea that it was in there I'm glad that it was though because I didn't remember where I saw the car key in the last playthrough that we did and I assume it would have been in the same spot so now all we have to do is get upstairs get the cog out of the sink and then run back downstairs get the master key hopefully Granum is not quite awake yet although i think that she is so i'm just gonna do this as fast as i possibly can please be the master key please save me save master key yes we're done all we have to do is get to the front door spider-man has escaped the jaws of granum get out of there get out of there okay we did it is the outside gonna be any different i don't think dr hack typically changes the outside but Granum's different. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's real freaky. <laughs> that is oh my gosh. Ooh, that face. That's a special face. Face only a mother could love. Do you think Venom has a mother? Do you think that mother loves Venom? Maybe? I don't know. But there you have it, guys. Granum. The Venom Granny combo mod super strange but if you guys want to check out this mod for yourselves i will have a link in the description down below but that's going to do it for this episode if you enjoyed it be sure to hit that like button and of course if you'd like to see more you can subscribe to my channel by clicking on that little circle with my logo in it right below this window you can also watch more of my videos by clicking on the sides of the screen but otherwise thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys next time